Hello everyone, happy to be here. In this video, I'm going to add map to the to our virtual tour. So far, we only have these two buttons here to change skyboxes or to change the panorama. And let's try to make a map instead. I have some images here, a map image, and a drop pin image like this and let's use it here uh, I'm going to add an image element to the canvas UI image and place it here I name it map make it full screen and change the color to black reduce opacity a bit then I add a child element which is image this one will be the actual map image set native size scale it down this way <coughs> now I'm going to delete this text from the buttons and I will use this map pin image as the source image set native size reduce it a bit like this and this button 1 a uh, button 2 will be here and button 1 will be here let me scale it scale them down first one is here second one is here let's disable this map object first oh yeah this button 1 and button 2 should be the should be child of of this map image here and let's disable this one now we will add uh, another button we will use it as map icon map button. we place it here and use the same map image as the source image scale it down and I make sure the position is nice okay and we need to create a script guys hang on a second here we are going to create a script let's call it tour ui edit the script let's edit the script we create a public void toggle game object function parameter will be game object go if statement if go dot active then go dot set okay that's all now we are going to attach the tour UI script to our canvas UI and here map button we will call the function oops 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 why do we have to okay 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 I added multiple script here let's remove okay we have two UI script here now we call that script to UI toggle game object and we pass this object as the reference as the target object to toggle and for 
this one for the map button for this button and this button both of them we will add the on click event to them and we will call the toggle game object the same thing as before everything is correct and now disable the map parent let's try to play it okay we are here now let's open the map we switch this to this map open the map switch to this map okay but we need to place this map icon behind the map the behind the full map so we need to place it here and the map let's increase the opacity like okay let's play it again click the map and click the hotspot and we will go over that place just like this okay that's all for this video thank you for watching see you next time guys bye bye